In this video, we will learn about the search term. Let's say a user visits your online shopping website and search something in the search bar. Then you should know what he searched so that you, you can easily redirect him to any place on the website. So let's see how we can go for it. Here you can see on the website, on the left you can see search bar is visible, search entire store here. Let's say a user entered fitness, on pressing enter he should go to the fitness equipment section. So now we will see how we can go through it. Here you can see on the right we need to go to the dashboard first by login as an admin. Here you can see we can easily check all the search term which users has availed. Here you can see go to marketing, on reaching marketing. Here you can see the sections are visible. Under SEO and search you can see search term section is visible, click on it. Now here you can see on clicking search term a section is visible where you can see what users search for the queries. User search for men clothes, bags as well as watches right now. So here you can see, here you can also set the redirect URL. Here you can check, the redirect URL is visible. Now let's say you need to add a new section for fitness. So after adding that section on your website, adding products related to fitness equipment, you want users to be redirected to that link whenever they type fitness. For that we need to add a new search term. So click on add new search term. Now here you can see a section is visible to add a new search term. Here you need to add the search query, I will type fitness here, store, the default store the, which we are using the resources for, which is default store view, redirect URL, I will copy the URL for fitness equipment and place it here, display in suggested term, display, yes we will go for it, we, will, we want to display it in suggested terms. So now let's add the query and redirect URL, so let's add it. So here you can see I have added the search query fitness and on typing fitness and pressing enter it will redirect to the following URL which is for our fitness equipment. Here you can see fitness equipment is under gear, here you can see fitness equipment. So now we will just click on save on the left, click on save search. Now here you can see we have clicked on save search and now you save the search term. Right now in the bottom you can see fitness query is visible, on pressing fitness enter you can see it will redirect to the following URL which is fitness equipment. So now let's go to the website, here you can see we have reached the website, go to the home page. Now here you can see on the left I will type the term fitness and press enter and let's see what happens. Here you can see I have added a term fitness and press enter. Now let's see what happens. Now here you can see the section is visible. Now it has been redirected to fitness equipment link which is the following which we added in the search terms here. Here you can see we added the following link. So here you can see in this way we can easily create search terms for user so that it's easier for user to navigate the website. So in this video we learned what is the value of search term, how we can easily go through and check all the search terms, the search queries and how we can easily add a search query so that user gets re redirected to the URL which we want. Thank you for watching.